welcome students in a series of volume have you seen these ice cubes and this kind of box they are examples of cube or cuboid so today's topic is volume of cube and cuboids the volume of solid is the amount of space enclosed by it or the amount of space it takes up at first just consider a line segment line segment represents length and the unit is centimeter like for example this line segment is of 1 cm and a square is a 2d shape which has side 1 cm each and the amount of space enclosed by this square is called area and the area of this square is 1 cm square it means the unit of area is cm square now let us come on the solid it is a solid or we can say 3d shape which is a cube a cube with sides of 1 cm each here each side is of 1 cm and here the space enclosed by this cube or cuboid is called volume and here it is 1 cm cube unit of volume we know that the volume of solid is the amount of space enclosed by it or the amount of space it takes up so volume of a cuboid which has side of 1 cm each it means it is a cube that is 1 cm cube here we can write like this also 1 cubic cm so cm cube or cubic cm or we can represent like this also 1 cubic cm cu instead of cubic so these are the ways to write unit of volume and unit is cm cube if this cuboid has side of each is of 1 m each then the unit of volume will be changed with meter cube so it is 1 m cube or either 1 cubic meter or we can write 1 cubic meter in this way too we can find the volume of solid in a two way one is by counting cubes or another is by formula so here at first we will learn how to find volume by counting cubes so here are few examples here is one figure just see this figure observe this figure the volume of each small cube is 1 cm cube which is given to us now let us calculate how many cubes there are so there are four cubes how just see here 1 2 3 4 it means we can say the volume of this shape is 4 cm cube let us take another shape now let us count these cubes 1 2 3 4 in similar way fourth cubes will be of other side it means total 8 cm cube is the volume of this shape now let us see another shape 1 2 3 4 4 and here are 1 2 3 it means total 12 cubes on this first level and two cubes are on these 12 cubes it means total 14 cm cube which is the volume of this shape now let us take another shape here are also two levels on first level we can see 1 2 3 and here are 1 2 3 it means 3 3 is a 9 9 cubes on first level and 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 6 6 cubes are on second level it means 9 plus 6 15 so the volume of this shape is 15 cm cube let us find out the volume of one more figure here is a figure it is a cuboid and here is the volume of each small cube is 1 cm cube let us count the cubes 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 12 cubes in this first layer in second layer also another 12 cubes in third layer also 
another 12 cubes. So total cubes are 36. It means the volume of this cuboid is 36 centimeter cube. Now let us find out the formula. If you will see this one small cube has side of 1 centimeter. It means the total length of this cuboid is 4 centimeter and the breadth is 3 centimeter and height is 3 centimeter. It means we can say the length equal to 4 centimeter, breadth equal to 3 centimeter and height equal to 3 centimeter. So volume of cuboid equal to according to this formula length into breadth into height. Let us put the values 4 centimeter into 3 centimeter into 3 centimeter. Let us calculate 4 3 is a 12, 12 3 is a 36 and the unit is centimeter cube. So volume of cuboid equal to 36 centimeter cube. Let us find out the formula for volume of cube. You know that in cube all sides are equal. So we can write side instead of length, breadth and height. Side into side into side. So it is a formula for volume of cube. Let us find the volume of solid and write the unit with your answer. Here is a solid. Just observe this. What is the length of this solid? 12 cm. Breadth is also 12 cm and height is 10 cm. So volume of cuboid because it is a cuboid. So it is length into breadth into height. Let us put the values length equal to 12 cm and breadth equal to 12 cm and height also 10 cm. Let us multiply all and we will get the volume that is 1440 cm cube. Let us do one more. Here is one more cuboid or we can say it is a cube because each side is equal 1.2 centimeter and always remember every cube is also a cuboid too. So now here what is the volume? Volume of cube you know that is side into side into side. Let us put the values 1.2 into 1.2 centimeter into 1.2 centimeter. Let us multiply all and we will get 1.728 centimeter cube. So we have understood that volume of cuboid equal to length into breadth into height. But what if volume of cuboid is given and you need to find out any one of them either length either breadth or either height. We can find out the formula by ourselves. How? You know that length into breadth into height equal to volume of cuboid. If you need to find out length let us transfer these values breadth and height to other side and you know that when we will transfer these values to other side they will come in form of division. So what is the formula length equal to volume of cuboid divided by breadth into height. In similar way if we need to find out breadth the formula will be volume of cuboid divided by length into height and if we need to find out height then it is volume of cuboid divided by length into breadth. Let us do one question of that kind. Volume of cuboid equal to 2100 millimeter cube. Breadth equals to 70 millimeter. Height equals to 5 millimeter. And length we need to find out. So how we will do? We will use this formula. Length equals to volume of cuboid divided by breadth into height. So we will put the values 2100 divided by 17 to 5. Let us solve this. How we can solve it? It is very easy. How? 7 3s are 21. And we can cut this 0 by 0. Now here 30 divided by 5 and you know 5 ones are 5 and here it is 5 6 are 30 so what is the answer 6 millimeter so you can find out either breadth or height also if another three things are given to you so in mathematics what you need to do yes practice because practice makes perfect so do practice.